In algebra, we use y equals mx plus b, such as an example, y equals 2x plus 3. In this, in algebra, we use y which depends on what gets plugged in for x. In this class, we will have x1 and x2, which represents a quantity, an amount of things. On a graph, x1 is going left or right, and x2 is going to be going up or down. Okay, So point A is up 0, so that x2 would be 0 there. Okay, x1 is our over, and x2 is our up and down. In point B, point B is left or right zero, so that would mean x1 is zero on point B. To graph using intercepts, let's graph four, uh, sorry, 3x1 plus 4x2 equals 24. Step one, plug in zero for x1 and solve for x2. So we would have three times zero plus 4x2. 3 times 0 is 0, so we have 4x2 equals 24. Divide both sides by 4, so x2 equals 6. x2 equals 6 when x1 equals 0. Step 2, plug in 0 for x2 and solve for x1. 3x1 plus 4x2 equals 24. Plug in 0 for x2, so 4 times 0 is 0. We get 3x1 equals 24. So divide by 3, we get x1 equals 8. x1 equals 8 when x2 equals 0. Okay, so what does that give us? Our first point was x1 is 0, x2 is 6. And our second one x1 is 8 and x2 equals 0. So we're going to plot those. Okay, so x1 is positive, so we'll go right for that. x2 is positive, so we'll go up for that. So point A, 0, 6 means go over 0 and up 6. Point B, 8, 0 means right 8, up 0. For a second example, 2x1 plus 6x2 equals 18. Plug in 0 for x1. 2 times 0 is 0. So 6x2 equals 18. Divide by 6, x2 equals 3. x2 equals 3 when we plug in x1 equals 0. Okay, then on the right side there, x2 equals 0 plug in. So we get 2x1 plus 6 times 0 equals 18. 6 times 0 is 0. 2x1 equals 18. Divide both sides by 2 and we get 9 for x1. And we got that when we plugged in x2 equals 0. Okay, so there's our point. When x1 is 0, x2 is 3. So that means over 0 and up 3. Okay, so this is the point 0, 3 right here. The second point was x1 would equal 9 when we plugged in x2 equals 0. So this is the point 9, 0. Okay, so make sure you put in x1 and x2 in correctly. Put them in to the parentheses correctly. Okay, you should always have x1 first, x2 second. And that's the end of this lesson.